This year we're going to celebrate 100 years of Dormagen. And to celebrate the event, we want to create another new artwork in Covestro colors. We've chosen the Polyol Warehouse. It's just by gate 10. And on it, we're painting 328 bricks, some of them up to 10 square meters of color. And they will have all six colors of the Covestro logo. And the illustration is designed to show bricks moving, things in motion, the logistics that our entire business relies upon. We of course asked ourselves where a suitable location for this artwork would be here in Dormagen, and actually nothing worked better than our warehouse, where the products are made, where they are then stored and stacked before going to the customer. Industrial art is exciting because it's mostly big projects and that gives you a new, different kind of space to work with. It's also something new for the observer as well who isn't expecting a designed industrial building. It's something new, something fascinating. That's Covestro. Artwork means emerging into a colourless industrial landscape as something bright and colourful, attracting attention and being different from the competition. We normally work with a different focus and it's obviously a bit different to be contributing to a piece of artwork like this. There were lots of points which had to be considered, starting with the variable amounts of weights hanging from the roof. Working with suspended scaffolding was also new to us. How do you safely get people out of the gondolas and back down? The challenge lay in the fact that the whole previous coating had to be removed, meaning blasting off using pressured water. Second step, replastering everything with a special kind of concrete, then priming, then finding out exactly what size a building block would need to have in order to draw out the whole thing in proportion and standing straight, to leave all of the positioning and lines and the information behind for the painters so they could smooth out the surfaces. Which colours? Where's the light? Where are the shadows? I was inspired by the size of the building, the good visibility, and no windows, meaning that there are flat surfaces, hardly any elements to distract the observer, and you can obviously let loose way better than with a normal house facade. At the beginning, there was certain scepticism, but when you see the whole thing develop, the fun factor gets bigger and bigger. It's something special. We're starting a conversation with the artwork, with the building, and that's definitely a great thing. The team is super important. You need to have a joke here and there. Things should be as stress-free as possible. Everyone should have the time to both go about it sensibly and also have some fun with it. I find it absolutely brilliant that Covestro has taken it upon itself to transform different buildings into works of art. People look at it and say, I think it's cool, I think it's great. The way the whole thing fits into this landscape, with the Rhine, the riverbank, and overall how it stands out from the scenery, that's what accounts for the fascination. I always find it great to see how a building can be totally transformed by colour, so that the actual function is no longer in the foreground, but instead people notice the design. That's something which always makes me proud. That is for me what makes me always proud. This artwork project brings together our colleagues with the company culture in a curious, colourful and courageous way when they enter the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. That's a symbol for our activities and the building. It brings colour to what is otherwise a grey industry. And to celebrate the actual inauguration, we're going to create the world's largest human forklift truck made out of many hundred people. This is great. I think there's so many smiling faces and children and all sorts of people from the local community are with us and it's fabulous. I think we're going to make it. We need a minimum of 250 people. 
Und heute haben sie... Today we count to 694 people. You set a new Guinness World Record. Guinness World Record system. It's great. We've now got a Guinness record in Dormagen. Over 600 people here. This is what world records are about. Getting people closer together. There are no barriers. We're all people at the end of the day. That feels very good. The feeling of togetherness. And that's what Kavestra has done in the past two years, which we are doing in great cohesion. This makes us proud that today we could motivate so many people. This is a crazy feeling. Everything went well. I met great colleagues. And for Dormagen, it's a special sign. I am overwhelmed. Today the record attempt went really well. It was very well organised. All the participants had a positive attitude. It was really good. Next step? Well, watch this space. There's more to come. But for sure, we're going to carry on making the world a brighter place. Mm -hmm.